Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone, especially the honorable judges, teachers, and everyone here today. How are you? I hope all of you here are in a good condition. My name is Cahaya Rea Ayunidia, and I am from Primary School of Muhammadiyah to JKB Music. The Honorable Judges, Ladies and Gentlemen, Today, I am going to tell you a story about General Sudirman, who was motivated all of the Muhammadiyah millennial generation future leader to enlighten Indonesia from adversity. On January 24, 1916, Sudirman was born in Rembang, Purbalingga. Raden Chokrasenario, who was a head of sub-district, adopted him as a foster child because of the economical situation of Sudirman's parents. Sudirman was grown in Purbalingga and moved to Cilacap for studying. After moving to Cilacap, Sudirman studied at HIS Cilacap and continued his junior high education at Muro. There, Sudirman was learned about various sciences, organizational experiences, and developing religious knowledge. Apart from the formal schools, Sudirman was also regularly participated himself on some activities, such as religious events and recitation, which was taught by Muhammadiyah figures. At that time, the combination of religious, aspect and spirit of nationalism built himself to become a great person. In 1935, Suleiman began to be active in Muhammadiyah and joined the Pemuda Muhammadiyah. Because of his skills on leadership, and great personality made himself trusted to occupy the position of deputy of Pemuda Muhammadiyah, are known as Muhammadiyah Youth Council. In other side, Sudirman also actively joined and raised his Buwatan. Sudirman has a perfect journey on his career in educational sector and also in organizational experiences. That the reason why Sudirman became a popular figure who got respect from the Indonesians. Sudirman gave the message of maintaining and developing the Muhammadiyah while he went to military training and PETA. In 1945, Sudirman was appointed by President Sukarno as the Commander-in-Chief of TKR. Sudirman's legacy for Indonesia are immeasurable, not only as a soldier, but also as a leader. Teacher and preacher, he motivated all of the Indonesians. That is the proof there are so many places and streets have the name of him. General Sudirman. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are as millennials generation future leader should remember and respect on General Sudirman's struggle for our nation. We are able to continue his struggle by becoming a good leader in the future and always mentioning Muhammadiyah as well as General Sudirman said. Well, I think it's enough from me. Thank you for your nice attention. And the last I say is Wassalamualaikum Warahmatullahi Wabarakatuh.